Hey guys, welcome to the channel. In this video, we're going to do water change on my two mini tanks. These are the tanks that I have in my house right now. I'm sorry I haven't uploaded in a while. I just moved and uh, I just didn't bring a lot of tanks with me and life got in the way. But I have this little cube, it's about five gallons. We're doing a water change on it. I'm doing full Wallstead, um, no filter. It does have a heater in it though and um, good light a lot of uh, plants sticking out the top a lot of pothos and there's a good amount of plants inside I think honestly it is overstocked I have a betta in there and my mom put an endler male and a endler female in there it's got shrimp it's got snails it's a little too much for this cube but it's very pretty very very pretty pretty cube um, and you'll see the other tank a little later. Uh, it's the TV tank. If you've watched the channel, you know what tank I'm talking about. I still have that tank. But go ahead and get this water changed. Here's the TV tank. Um, this one's a classic. It looks a lot different now than it used to, to be honest with you. But it grows a lot of guppy grass. It just has shrimp and snails and an algae eater in there. The algae eater is keeping it clean um, also doesn't have a filter it used to it used to have a filter but I took it out and it did just fine and the plants are exploding also has pothos growing out of it and if anything dies the snails just get get cleaning they get eaten at all the detritus and the dead plants and whatever so these tanks do so so well they grow a lot of duckweed that is a an easy way for me to remove bi uh, biological material is uh, is taking out that duckweed but other than that I don't do much I just feed them and top them off with water this was about five gallons I believe really really proud of this uh, if if you are interested I'll try to put the video of me creating this tank in the comments no, in the description, my bad. In the description. Go watch it. Very cool. Very interesting. Um, I do want to say that I am pivoting the content on this channel. Uh, if you are a fan of the channel, I did a lot of, you know, fish tank related stuff and fish related stuff, aquascaping, all that stuff. But I do want to pivot into more essay style stuff. Uh, you know having to do with nature I st will still do the occasional you know aquarium content but I'm pivoting away from that just because I don't have as many tanks now and my life isn't as stable as it used to be I'm moving around a lot and things are changing very rapidly for me but I do want to keep making content and talk about things that I'm interested in so Stay tuned if you want to, you know, see more of that stuff. I do recommend going over to, well, I don't recommend, I don't know. If you want to, have another channel. It's just called David Mush. It is my name. It's just the stuff that, like, kind of my hobbies and stuff. You know, uh, here, here's a clip of me putting more uh, water into this tank. I love this tank, by the way. I love this tank. Um, anyways... Yeah, so I'm doing woodworking, I'm doing, you know, I do home brewing and just stuff like that. So go check out that channel. You might, uh, if you, you know, want more content from me, you'll see it over there also. Anyways, back to this tank. I love this tank. It is so beautiful. Everything about it. It's just so green. Here it is. Pulling stuff off the top. It's just such a pretty, pretty tank, guys. But anyways, thanks for watching. I'm so glad you guys are still around watching. And if you're new to the channel, go check out my other stuff. But anyways, thanks for watching.